paint blistering issues on the 2018 on up Jeep Wrangler JLs. You may want to check yours. Stay tuned. Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Wanted to make you guys aware of an issue that uh, is getting more and more common on the new JL Wranglers. Um, it is an issue with the paint blistering on the hood, the doors, and the uh, rear door hatch, uh, mostly around the hinges, but we'll show you other places too. So what's happening, my wife's uh, Jeep Wrangler Rubicon is a 2019. We have uh, 22,000 miles on it. Uh, the issue right here is if you take a look, see the paint blistering. So this paint is actually blistering on the hood itself and not on the hinge, but it gets worse in other places. So we've got the hinge here. We've got some blistering starting to happen here. This one's really bad. Uh, you can see the paint all bubbling here. If we go to the back hinge, starting to happen here and then look at this one this one blistered so bad that uh, some of the paint actually already started popping off so that's the driver's side if we go over to the passenger side got another section here where did I see it uh, it's starting to blister right there also uh, these two front hinges are both okay and actually even around the hinge, around the door. So I'm hoping this door won't be affected. Uh, this one has got some of the blistering going on here and here also, and then here, and then this is the worst part. This is the first thing that we saw was the blistering on the door isn't even related to the hinge. Uh, one of my wife's girlfriends had said, hey, you know what, <laughs> your, your paint's rusting already. And I came out and looked at this and I was like, holy cow. So when we took it to the dealership, they were the ones that you know noticed all of the other uh, bubbling happening on the hinges and had said, yeah, this is a common problem. So um, I've been on jlwranglerforums.com. Uh, There's 160 something pages with people having this exact same issue. Um, the dealerships are you know warranting the work. Uh, my wife went in with ours. Uh, they took a look at it. They're using a local body shop that they've used before for the same thing. Uh, right now, we are towards the end of September of 2022. Our appointment is not until January of next year. So um, they're supposedly supposed to repaint the, uh, the hinges and the doors. Uh, I don't think they found any blistering on the uh, real, rear tailgate. So, But anyways, it's quite concerning. Um, I know there's going to be a lot of people out there that go, oh, this is because, you know, they went to aluminum hood and aluminum doors on this car. You know, the aluminum really has nothing to do with it. Um, I've got a 2015 F-150. That was the first year of the all aluminum body. Um, you know, the truck is eight years old now and uh, the paint on this thing is absolutely perfect. There's no corrosion. It all comes down to, you know, the fact that the, um, the body... The aluminum, the metal has got to be prepped properly before it's painted. So, you know, um, definitely an issue with with Fiat Chrysler, you know, when they built this thing. So um, one of my friends has an 18. I told him about it. We took a look at it. He already had blistering on the hood, too. So he's taken his in. In the forums, I had seen that um, as early as the, you know, the first model year, the JLs, the 2018s, they were having issues, too. I do not know if it goes past... Uh, the 19 so I don't know if the 20 through the 22s are affected or not you would have thought that maybe they would have found this issue so anyways just want to let you guys know uh, if you have a JL you know just do your due diligence uh, check out the area uh, especially you know the the points that I mentioned um, even some of the weird spots that aren't by the hinge um, just like the door edge like uh, you know I showed you how bad mine was so um, and get it in and get it fixed because it's supposed to be covered under their uh, corrosion warranty. So I had heard rumors of a class action lawsuit that may be brewing too. So uh, kind of keep your ears out for that too. All right. Thanks everybody. Good luck. We'll catch you on the next one.